Hey guys, we got another edition of Let's Keep It Simple, and today I'm going to show you the five essential city tweaks that every jailbreaker needs to have. Best of all, they're all completely free. Now these aren't necessarily the coolest or the greatest city tweaks, but they're definitely the essentials that you'll want to download every time you jailbreak your device. So let's get to it. First, we got SB settings. This tweak is extremely helpful. By a simple gesture on the screen, a main menu will drop down, giving you several icons, allowing you to activate or deactivate certain settings. Green means it's on, and red means it's off. This tweak will save you tons of time, since you won't have to open up settings and navigate for what you want. You can put your phone in airplane mode, deactivate or activate your Wi-Fi, adjust the brightness. You can download more settings in Cydia, and even reboot or turn off your iPhone right from SB settings. All right, next up is my favorite free Cydia tweak. It's called Activator, and this tweak is just awesome, and it shows you how great the jailbreaking community is. With this tweak, you can assign on-screen gestures to open up or switch applications, or by pressing the power button, the volume controls, and this is definitely the most useful tweak in Cydia. I've set it up so that a simple gesture will open up Cydia, one will turn on the flashlight, one will open up my camera, and another one will open up Twitter. This is just an example to show you what you can do with it. Next up, we have Winterboard. This is what you'll use to customize the look and feel of your iDevice. For example, if you want to change the look of your icons, the colors, the fonts, or anything else you want to do, you'll do it via Winterboard. Once you've downloaded a theme, you just go into Winterboard, select it, and then respring the application. And then when it opens up, you'll see your new themes activated. There's tons of different things you can do to customize your device, and there will be a more thorough guide on that part in the description. Speaking of themes, a huge time saver is Springtimize. This will give you tons of options to customize your device, giving you lots of control over how it looks and feels. And again, there's so many options with Springtimize that I wrote a, a more thorough guide, and I put a link to that in the description showing you more of the things that you can do with it. For example, you can change the color of the screen flash when you take a screenshot, and you can even have an animation when you turn your phone off to have an old TV look. And you can change the color of that as well. You can also make your icons transparent and eliminate your page dots. Like Winterboard, when you're done, you'll just hit Respring. And when it opens up, you'll see the changes you made. Lastly, if you plan on using Cydia to install things, you'll need Side Elite. It doesn't do anything that will blow your mind, but you'll probably get frustrated without it. Cydalee allows you to delete applications you installed via Cydia. Without Cydalee, you'd have to open Cydia, find the package, and manually delete it. With Cydalee, it's as easy as deleting any application. Hope you enjoyed watching the five Cydia tweaks that every jailbreaker should get for their iDevice. Now, like I said, these aren't necessarily the craziest and best applications out there in Cydia, just the ones to get you started and make your experience with their iDevice a bit more simple. Well, thanks for watching, and if you think there's a tweak we missed, let us know in the description below. We may end up doing more videos like this in the future, so give us some feedback is what you'd like to see. Well, that's all for this video. If you're new to jailbreaking, check out my video for how to change your password in mobile terminal, since you should change your password every time you jailbreak your iDevice. Well, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.